A state appeals court on Monday dealt the setback to environmentalists who challenged Minnesota's rules on hard rock mining. In a unanimous opinion, the Minnesota Court of Appeals said the rules developed by the DNR after public input in the early 1990s are valid. Environmentalists argued the rules are too vague to protect Minnesota's natural resources in a new age of mining on the Iron Range. Two companies are preparing to build the first copper nickel mines in Minnesota. Polymed has received permits to build an open pit copper nickel mine near Babbitt and hopes to begin major construction next year. Twin Metals Minnesota plans to submit a formal plan next year for an underground copper nickel mine just outside the Boundary Waters Canoe Area Wilderness. DNR Deputy Commissioner Barb Naramore said the agency is pleased the judges affirmed the rules. The conservation groups challenging the rules criticized the court's decision. Kevin Ruth, who is the legal director for the Minnesota Center for Environmental Advocacy, says non-ferrous mining presents new and unknown dangers and that the DNR's rules are not sufficient to protect Minnesota's resources. The center represents five other conservation groups. All are considering an appeal to the Minnesota Supreme Court. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.